everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a makeup look inspired by the new film that's coming out called The Neon Demon. Now the film is by Nicholas Winding Ref, I think that's how you pronounce it, and he directed films such as Drive, Bronson and Only God Forgives. So obviously some really well-known films there. The film is basically a stylish surreal glimpse at the dark underside of the fashion and modeling industry so it's got some really really amazing makeup and outfit looks within the film um i'll pop a link below to the trailer it is coming out on the 8th of july and it stars some really well-known people such as l fanning christina Hendricks. Jenna Malone and the supermodel Abby Lee. So I've actually created two makeup looks already, which one's already on my Instagram and another will be featuring on Friday. And they're just inspired by looks within the film. This look I'm gonna be doing now is a look on Elle Fanning. Now I'll try and get up a picture and show you the look that I'm gonna create. So it's this one here. So as you can see, She's got some amazing sort of embellishment around to her eyes. So I'm going to be creating that. I don't think I'm going to go really heavy on the blood. I'm not sure I'm going to do the blood at all, really, because it's scary. But no, so I'm going to just focus on the eye makeup because I think it's really, really stunning and it's very me. I absolutely love embellishment, face gems and glitter and everything. So I'm really, really excited to create this look for you. So I'm going to be using a couple of different gems. I've got a little pot from Go Get Glitter. So it's got a couple of beads, sequins and things in there. Then I've got some other sort of sticky gems that I've collected over time from like eBay, Wicked Hippie. A little packet there so I'm gonna just mix and match and try and create it now the look is symmetrical on both eyes so what I'll do to this one I'll do to the other side and I'm just gonna finish off with a pink lip which I will create a baby pink lip using makeup forever's flash palette really really good palette and then I'll just finish off with a little bit of um, neon shadow on my eyes using Urban Decay's electric palette and then I'm going to create some <clears throat> sort of fake looking lashes using mascara and some tweezers to tweeze them together. So I've already got my base makeup on. As you can see, if you want to know how to do this, you can check out my everyday makeup routine video or one of my other makeup videos I've recorded doing my base before the eye makeup. So I'm going to get started. I'll speed the video up just so it's quicker for you to watch. And also I'm going to be using Go Get Glitters glue um, to stick the gems on with. It's amazing. It's um, actually water soluble, I think that's the right word. So it comes off really, really easy with water. Um, and it, But it sticks anything on your face and it stays on there. So let's get started.
going to quickly pop together the hair look which is basically two plaits coming across the top of my hair so I'm just going to give that a go and then I will show you the complete finished look afterwards. And then this is Elle Fanning from the movie. So as you can see, I have attempted to copy the makeup look. Obviously I've used my own different gems and I've tried to colour match them so they're quite similar and I tried to get ones that are similar sizing. I think I've done a all right job. And then I finished off with the pink lip and then I've just sort of braided my hair forwards and then twisted them over and just clipped it all into place and then just clipped the back up with curvy grips so yeah I actually love this look I think it's really really cool um I mean I would totally wear this out to be honest with you especially with the festival season coming up it's a, the perfect look to wear for your festival makeup so I definitely do love it and I love how simple the look is but it looks really stunning on so i hope it did the look justice i would definitely recommend going to see the film because it the trailer just looks incredible so i'm definitely going to go and see it just purely because of how incredible the makeup and the fashion looks so for a blogger like me someone that's really interested in that i'm kind of want to go and see the film for that aspect but also I'm a bit intrigued as to see their take on the dark side of the modelling industry. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you did please like the video and subscribe to my channel. Peace out!